Depression affects more than 17 million Americans each year. Even more startling, less than half of those suffering seek treatment. Today, we're joined by local experts to talk about depression, how to prevent it, and how to treat it. With me now is Dr. Jim Jacobson, and I'm really amazed by the number of phone calls we've been getting ever since we put 333 WPXI on screen. The phones have just been ringing off the hook. Well, it certainly shows you how common depression is and how many people are trying to reach out and to feel better and to have an improved mood. Do you know whether it's a problem in this area specifically? Uh, it's throughout the United States and throughout the world. 20% uh, of all people will experience a major clinical depression sometime during their life. Now, how can you tell the difference between depression and just feeling bad over a long period of time? Well, feeling bad, the blues, feeling sad. It's a normal reaction to life uh, circumstances, bad things. Uh, clinical depression is an illness. Uh, it's, it's more than just the mood of, of feeling sad, which, which of course happens. It also affects uh, social, uh, bodily functions. People tend to lose appetite, can lose weight, sleep disturbances feelings of worthlessness, even you know, feelings of suicide. That's right. We have some of those, th some of those things on our screen okay, right now. Yes. Restless fatigue, even suicidal thoughts, Correct. as you mentioned. Now, what, what's also amazing to me is that women are, what is it, twice as likely than men to suffer depression? That's, for clinical uh, major depression, that's true. Uh, we're not exactly sure why that is. Uh, I mean, other mental illnesses, such as even bipolar, manic depression, men and women uh, are equal. And the same with schizophrenia, but for depression, uh, it seems that women are twice as uh, likely to be afflicted. But are women also twice as likely to seek help? Um, unfortunately, with depression, only about half the people who uh, would be helped uh, actually do seek help. Now, there is the number on your screen. If you need to seek help, call 333-WPXI. The depression hotline operators are standing by. Thank you very much, Thank Dr. You. Jacobson.